Hey, my name is Matt Starr, and I repair saxophones for a living. And today I'm just making a very short video about um, painted saxophones, or actually more like enameled. Um, back in the 20s, there actually were saxophones like this Bisher Straight Alto that were made with their original finish being enamel. Um, and typically it was Duco enamel, uh, D-U-C-O. Uh, and this one, we can take a close look at what the engraving looks like. You can see it's through the enamel into the horn. Um, and this is the original warranty uh, card. And you can see saxophone model 120, that's the straight alto green duco body. There's the serial number. Um, and we can see that serial number matching on the back of the instrument here. Now the serial number was painted over um, and someone looks like this was probably patched up a little bit after the fact. This particular instrument was a special order by an Irish band. Um, it was more common to see them in red or black. You can see cons like this, particularly for some reason C melodies seem to be in colors, perhaps because C melodies were more often in novelty acts, and this probably would have been considered a novelty saxophone as well. A green straight alto in an Irish band. Um, but basically I'm just making this video because you know, every once in a while I see it mentioned, um, you know, people talk about painted saxophones, and there were a few that were originally like this. Not many, they're exceedingly rare, but if they were originally painted or enameled, um, this is what they looked like. We can get up close and see the finish here a little bit. You can see it goes over the edge of the tone hole. The inside of the bell on this one is lacquered, and the keys are lacquered. You can see how it's worn a bit around the octave thumb rest down to the brass. But yeah, painted saxophones did exist. I'll also put a couple links uh, down below um, to show you some more photos. I know that Quinn the Eskimo, a prolific eBay seller, has a few uh, painted saxophones that are cons. I've actually seen them in person. They're pretty cool. But yeah, just a quick proof that there were originally saxophones that were enameled. That is a real thing. Um, typically what you see today is someone, you know, spray painted a saxophone, which is not the same thing, but there are a few original finish from the 20s usually, 1920s, uh, enameled saxophones. I think Selmer did a couple as well, um, but mostly you'll see the ones you see are Con or Bisher as far as I know.